What's up, OG Beauties? It's Mommy. And it's me. And as you can see from the title today, we're going to be showing you a quick and easy back to school hairstyle. This is her day three, maybe four hair. Turn around. And this is what her hair is looking like. So we like how fluffy it is in the back and the curls are still, sorry I pulled on it a little bit. And the curls are still pretty good and intact. So what we're gonna do is a quick and easy half up, half down hairstyle. So the way that I like to do the half up, half down is I like, like to have a cute little poof right here. Um, so I'm gonna start from right, literally right behind where her ear, like right at the tip of her ear, and that's where I'm gonna part all the way across. Waking up early in the morning and trying to get yourself ready while trying to get your kids ready for school can be exhausting and stressful and one of you guys end up looking a little bit of a mess. Um, so quick and easy hairstyles that are quick but can, are still very cute can get your kid out of the way so you can kind of focus on yourself so you can get ready for work. So that's why I'm kind of showing you guys some back to school hairstyles that I do that are quick in the morning so it can get you guys on the road and, and get, get to going a lot faster. Um, and now I'm gonna go ahead and explain why I part where I do, let me see. So I do part from right where her the tip of her ear meets her hairline up. Um, there's a lot of people that do part from the back of the ear and part straight this way, like kind of that part straight instead of curved and over. Um, and that kind of makes the hair lay flatter. I like the more voluminous look. Um, so that's why I part at an arch. So I part from, I go up instead of back. If that makes any sense, I feel like. You'll see, I'll, I'll, I'll post a picture of a half up, half up, half down hairstyle on curly hair that is um, a straight back part that kind of parts the hair completely in half instead of more like a three quarters of a hairstyle. I have it parted how I like the part. Now I just take this, the curly part that's gonna be down and I just kind of tie it up and get it out the way. Now with this, because her curls are also still pretty intact at the ends. What I'm gonna do is take a spray bottle. I'm gonna spray right here. I'm gonna I'm gonna add some gel, and I'm gonna brush it up into a ponytail. I'm not gonna spray it so it's soaked. I'm just gonna get it a little damp, just like that. I'm gonna work it with my fingers. All right. And then I'm just gonna take just a little bit of Eco Style gel, not too much. Bit of eco style gel and just brush it right here. Okay, so now that the gel is applied, I am going to go ahead and just smooth this into the ponytail. Okay, so now you can see there are some, she had, well you can't really see it, but in the back there are some curls that were just a little bit messed up. We're just gonna spritz those and just finger coil them so that when they dry they'll be nice and cute like the rest of the curls. We're not too mad at any of the frizz that's going on, but now we're gonna drop down this scrunchy part. And you have a super cute hairstyle. Now you can leave it like this if you would like. It's a super cute half up, half down. Or if you have some extra time, you can go ahead and spruce it up just a little bit more. I'm gonna go ahead and take some curls down here. Right here at the edges. I'm 
not every hairstyle needs edges at all by any means so please do not feel the need to get some edges for every single hairstyle sometimes it's just really cute to leave some of the little baby curls out and let them do what they want to do now you can go in with some gel and and lay some edges if you want but i'm sorry i'm too picky with the way that i like her edges to look so i don't have time to go in and lay the edges because in the morning when i'm trying to get ready and trying to have her looking good me having to play with her edges is not going to do anything but frustrate us and have us there for a long time so now i'm going to go ahead and take a cute scrunchie that matches the outfit that she's wearing today bless you and we're gonna go ahead and add that so she has a pop of color if the wind blows now the back some people don't really want all of that frizz that's fine um i go ahead and i'm gonna take this carol's daughters let's see if it'll focus on it i have this carol's daughters um black vanilla um leave-in conditioner spray i'm gonna go ahead and spritz her hair with that um i mostly use this just for the smell um and to maintain some of the frizz so i'll spray it and i'll just kind of push it into her curls so it kind of gives her like a like a wet look without giving her without like soaking her hair. And some of the super frizzed pieces, I will go ahead and finger coil so they don't look too crazy. But that is it. Do you see how fast that took? That was quick. Now all I would do is throw some earrings on her. pop some earrings on me. Sorry. And this is all I would do is Pop some earrings on this girl and she's ready for school that took like five minutes for me to do and if I was getting ready for work right now I would have some extra time to do my makeup my hair's not in braids so you know I mean if my hair wasn't in braids I would have some extra time to take care of my hair get dressed and that's it she's taken care of she's eating breakfast while I'm getting ready for school the simplicity and I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys a quick 360 Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and share. Comment down below what you guys want to see next. And don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget. It's Poppin' Girl. Mwah.